What's up, guys? Welcome to episode 9 of my entire Arky card plus. You know how I picked out the cards that look nice? Well, we're going to be going through this today. And the reason why they're all scattered is because I this is, has to be take 2 because I knocked over the camera. And it shut off. So I was going through the names. I'm probably not going to do that to make because I don't want this video to be too, too long. Because I'm going to go film episode 10. But yeah, I'll give you guys a little bit of a glimpse so you guys can see them. These ones have fake signatures on them. Which I think are really cool. So yeah, episode 10 will be out tomorrow morning, going through my jersey cards, my really my ones in my cases. So yeah, that's garbage. I hate Drew, as a Penguins fan, I hate Claude Drew. So I want a couple of pens in 09. Alright, that's those. And we're gonna go we'll go through my ice ones next. Actually no, we'll go through those last. We'll do those ones last, actually. Uh -uh. So yeah, we'll be going through those last. Well actually no, my ice ones I'll be going through the ones that you know had like the blue rink in it and the gold ones. Well the gold ones are actually in a case. I'll be going through those last. Nice little one there. It's a good shot. These ones are pretty cool. So yeah, we got a lot of a lot of them. Have, a lot of them are duplicates, but who cares? NHL Network. Yeah. Just those. Okay. Yeah, last time I was going through and saying it by the names, but um, I'm not going to do that this time because a lot of them I couldn't pronounce. And I took forever. And so, yeah, I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to show the card. And yeah. And that'll be that. Done. I'll put them back in the box. I mean, the box was full, and I still uh, couldn't fit them all. I really like these ones. Jersey's amazing. Yeah, I guess I know. I'm in the group of five people that actually likes it. Literally, comment below if you guys like or dislike the Fisherman jersey. I just want to hear you, hear Ian's opinion. I love it. I don't know why. It's just very different than what I'm used to than what I'm used to seeing for the Islanders. Best jersey of all time, right there. Love that flame jersey and logo. I don't know. It's just so different. I love. I really. The duck should still be using that logo in Jersey. I like that one better than the dark because it's white. And I like you guys know I like white jerseys better than dark. Yeah. And just let you know. That logo and that jersey do not go together whatsoever. That jersey only goes with the Fisherman logo. I don't know why the hell that logo is on that jersey because they do not go together. Period. End of sentence. It's an insert card. I don't know why the Islanders would... It's unbelievable that, that the Islanders Fisherman jersey 
only goes with that logo. When they switched it and put that their current logo on that jersey, that looks atrocious. Because that logo does not go with that jersey whatsoever. I can't believe they would do that. That combination, that logo and jersey, man, I, I don't get why everyone hates it. <laughs> I don't know why everyone hates it. It's amazing. I really don't know why everyone hates it. It's ridiculous. Well, how? Well, why do people hate it? It's, it's a good shot. It's ridiculous. Like I don't get why. I wish Buffalo would still would still be using that in the or uh, not that. Star. I like the Stars jerseys in the shape of a star. I'm not a fan of that logo. I love their current logo. One of the few teams I like their current logo is usually for teams that like past logos or third logos. Is that a, I don't know. Yeah, I'll, I think I have some of these coins, so I'll be good, definitely doing those. Oh. Uh, there we go. Yeah, I really like these shiny ones. Metal ones here are pretty sweet. So, yeah. And whenever I buy more hockey cards, I'm going to do an unboxing video. If I, if I even if I just buy a single jersey card, I'm going to do an unboxing video of it. So you get you guys will be able to see me add to my collection. I might. On my Twitter page, if you don't follow me on Twitter, follow me on Twitter. Send a picture of my closet that has all my hockey cards in it. So you guys will really we'll see how many, I mean, yeah, I should be able to know how many boxes, but just so you can see where I store it all. Graves is a piece of trash for hurting Mario Lemieux. I have a card like this. It's a rookie card, and there's like a rare one. It's worth fifty bucks. I have a one that was only like four hundred made. It's worth thirty. These ones are inserts, and I do have some of those in cases as well. And you'll also be seeing a ton of my, a ton of top shelf cards. The ones that I pulled out are ones that I, the well, the ones in here are, are doubles, or duplicates. So I, I don't have any duplicates in my cases. Yeah, top shelf ones are usually worth between they could be worth between a dollar and a couple thousand dollars. I mean, my dad had one that he sold for four hundred bucks. Like, I don't, I, I mean, it was worth twelve hundred, but I feel like he could have gotten like at least five. I don't know why he sold it for four hundred. I feel like he could have sold it for maybe a thousand. Because it was it was a top shelf jersey card. It had four different jerseys. And uh, there's only 10 made. I mean, I have a card that's only 10 made, and it's. I don't know, prong to play for the Whalers. Um, I have a card, my Joe Thornton Patrick Moore card is only 10 made, and it's only worth like 15. Textile's garbage. Sorry, it's upside down. Love that Canucks jersey. That mask is amazing. Completely amazing. Alright. 
a lot of my ice cards are there are duplicates. So I'm just letting you know that that there are a ton of duplicates in my ice ones. I didn't know Chris Oz could play for the Islanders. I thought he spent his entire career with Detroit. I had no idea he played with the Islanders. I guess he learned something new every single day. Apparently he learned something new every single day, guys. Love that jersey. I think this one's really sick. For this, the box is full. And we'll do I have another stack of these regular ones. Then we'll do my ice ones and we'll do these. They're just blue ones in there because my gold ones are in a case. And I do have a silver one as well. My dad let me have one. So, yeah. Yeah, and that's where I got all these hockey yards from my dad for free. I didn't, well, I mean, some of them I did buy. Like, I, like, I didn't get every single car to have for free. <laughs> I got, let's say, 99, like, 95% of them for free. Other ones, like, other ones I got as gifts, um, or I, some of them I bought. So, yeah. I think these ones are pretty neat. For I didn't know he played for LA. On Tuesday or Wednesday, there will be another vlog up because I'm going to the Penguins game Tuesday. So, watch out for the intro video. And watch out. I love that star jersey. And on post to post, you know, he does a thing where people can send videos of them at a hockey game. I'm going to do that. So, you'll probably see me on a post to post video. Alright, I'm going to move into my ice ones. A lot of my ice ones are... So there's different types of ice ones. The silver ones are standard. There's the there's blue, which are just give me here. You know I'll mention them. And I know there's. Uh, so yeah, we're gonna move on to the ice ones here. So there's a uh, different colors here. So this is the silver. So they're just standard. Then you have the blue ones, which are phenoms. Pretty sure. You and then you have performers that are red. Then you have legends, which are aqua. And then you have gold, which I'm not sure what they are. But you will be seeing an aqua one and a gold one tomorrow. There we go, I burped. Sorry guys, I have to, I'm gassy. I have to release gas, I'm sorry. Ooh. 
We actually, I actually have two gold ones. I actually pulled it out in one of the boxes. The Yins will probably remember that. Some of them have values for how much the cards are worth on them. Not all of them. I only did some. But I did all my jersey slash autograph cards. God, I did not know Cleary played for Chicago. So I thought Cleary spent his entire career with Detroit. I know he won a cup with Detroit in 08 when they beat the Penguins. And I hate Detroit because of that. Is when they beat all my Penguins. It's unfortunate that Crosby didn't get a cup that year. Because he would be a four-time Stanley Cup champion. Well, actually, he should be more like a six- or seven-time Stanley Cup champion for all the other years that they should have won it, like in the short season in 2012-2013. I can't believe they, they should have won the Cup that year, but they didn't. I blame Bowsman for that. Just because he's a terrible coach in the playoffs. And he actually works for NHL Network. Dan Bowsman. Two more ice ones, and then we're gonna go on to the ones that have the rinks in them, and that will be that. And that will be that. So that's the ice ones. Now let's hope I don't knock the camera over. All right, last ones. These, I think they're made out of like aluminum, I'm not sure. You can see that they're... These ones are the most common. You'll see when I get to my other ones. You'll see that they get rare. I mean, you have gold and you have silver, which the silver ones actually like change colors. It's pretty cool. My first one was the Hobby Bull and Phoenix one. We got the oh, it actually says where they're from. It's interesting. The Blues jersey is amazing. And the last one. Alright guys, so that is it for episode 9 of my entire hockey card collection. Um, like and subscribe for episode 10 tomorrow morning, uh, which is the final episode of this marathon, I guess you would call it. So I hope you enjoyed, and thanks for watching.